Time for our daily dose of entertainment news. Singer Sia talks about adopting two boys who actually aged out of foster care and the Kardashians are getting creative, as they always do, to keep their show on track. Here's Steph Haney with your Wednesday Pop Break. Sia might not show her face, but she wears her heart on her sleeve when it comes to her two adopted sons. She shared with Sirius XM that the boys were 18 when they officially became a family last year and were just about to age out of the foster care system. The Grammy-nominated singer said that like so many of us, her teenage sons are having a hard time adjusting to life during the coronavirus, but they're doing educational things to get through it. As for Sia, she's loving being a mom and says she's decided to be single for the rest of her life because she's too busy for a relationship. When one door closes, another one opens, right? At least that's what Spencer Pratt is hoping now that Kristen Cavallari and Jay Cutler have split, which a lot of people saw coming. I wouldn't have looked twice at Jay in high school. Why? He, wouldn't, he wasn't my type. I was hanging out with the bad boys, you know what I'm saying? Now that it's over, Kristen's TV series Very Cavallari is also ending, and Spencer is literally praying that she returns to the Hills reboot. Real quick, dear God, um, and everyone watching this, please add to this prayer. Um, We'd all love for Kristen Cavallari to join the Hills New Beginning, so let's put that out there in the universe. And pandemic or no pandemic, nothing is stopping the Kardashians from filming their reality TV show, and it's about to get more intimate than we ever imagined. The family is basically recording the rest of this season on their own individual iPhones, selfie style, which they have to swap out every week so the editors can get the footage. Unless you're Kim or Chloe, who hired a select few people to wear hazmat-style suits and set up lighting and phone-friendly tripods in their homes. Altogether, the Kardashians record about 16 hours of footage for a single episode, some obviously more than others, so you can understand why they got to be swapping out those iPhones every single week. And we can expect season 18 to continue in September. Okay, here's another one for you. NBC is finding a new way to have fun with Red Nose Day this year, and they're doing it with a special celebrity escape room tomorrow. Lisa Kudrow, Courtney Cox, Ben Stiller, Adam Scott, and Jack Black will all try to get out for a good cause, and each room will be full of puzzles, and each room that they escape raises more money to help children living in poverty. So this is the sixth annual NBC Red Nose Special, and it starts at 8 p.m. It's three hours long, Jay. There's going to be lots of comedy and fun surprises, and that's right here on Channel 3 tomorrow. Yeah, and Steph, that's a win-win. It's a lot of fun for the participants and for the audience, and as you said, it benefits a great cause. Steph, thanks. We'll see you tomorrow. Yes.